today the second batch of fort nightmares challenges have been released and i'm going to be breaking down how to complete every single one of them so let's jump right into it okay so first i'm just going to give you guys an overview there are three new challenges now you can ignore the eat candy one because that one is from last week well technically not last week but the last batch you guys know what i'm saying but the first one we have this week is deal damage with a possessed vehicle the second one we have is detect players as a shadow and then the third one is eliminate shadow midas now all of these give you xp and the third one actually gives you a smash o lantern which which is a pretty cool pickaxe. So let's jump right into how to complete all of them. <laughs> We are going to be starting these challenges off with the, the most difficult one just so that I can show you guys how to do it. But the first one is Eliminate Shadow Midas. Now, you guys all know where Shadow Midas is. If you don't, he's at the runes and he just kind of patrols around there. He randomly spawns around the place. So you may not get this your first try, but you will eventually find him here. And all you need to do is kill him and then take his loot and you will get this challenge completed. Okay, so as we drop down here, we just kind of want to look the top layer through through and see if we can see anyone since we can't right off the bat we're gonna land right inside get a gun immediately and then try and find Midas now as you're running around the rooms you're going to want to be listening to the sound of the drum gun try and figure out where he is and right here as you can see I found him and I took him out with a pump shotgun shot to the end then all you need to do is finish him off and you will finish your first challenge of the week eliminate shadow Midas and get your own new harvesting tool <laughs> For the second challenge of dealing damage with a possessed vehicle, you're going to want to come over to Stark Industries. Now, this place, while it seems like it might not be great, you can actually damage the robots and get your damage done. If you look at the quest, you actually see deal damage with a possessed vehicle. It does not say deal damage to players. So we're about to go do this. You just need to become a shadow. So basically just jump off the top of this building like I do right here. It does about 91 damage and then just walk over to one of the robots and let them shoot you. And then you will actually respawn as the ghost. All you need to do is hop into the car out front and actually hit one of these robots. All right, we're gliding on down as our ghost. And all we need to do is come on down here, drop right into the car that spawns out front. And then you will get free damage right here. You can see, bam. Tons of it. Wow, we phase through them when we do that? That's pretty cool. But if we actually go ahead and look at the challenge now, it shows us 100 out of 100. And see, deal damage with a possessed car is done. So the best way to do this one, come over to Stark Industries, grab one of the Tony Stark cars as a ghost, and then just ram into the AI that are around the map. <laughs> For the next challenge, all you need to do is also land at Stark Industries because there's typically a ton of people here and then just scan. Now, we're going to die in the process, but we got 5 out of 10 of our detect players as a shadow. Now, for those of you that don't know, this challenge is basically just detect players as a shadow, and that means that you just need to press the R button, and then you will actually detect players in a nearby area. So, if you do this twice, you will actually complete this challenge and get your Fort Nightmares Week 2 challenges all finished. So, if you guys found this tutorial helpful, please consider leaving a like on it and subscribing to the channel, as that would help me out a ton. Thank you so much for watching the video. Go subscribe to all my golden gummies. Their channels will be linked in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you have an amazing day and I will see you in the next one.